pebbles rattle like toddlers' toys across the beach. The relentless battle of the coming and going tide astride the wide reach from Doniford to Warren Bay and beyond. The sea at play. And responding, the sun rays stream out warmth and light across the hammered out land of rocks and trees and people. Gazing down from Dawes Castle to the town, from Cleave Hill to grazing sheep and the steep squeezed hillsides, marked out by St Peter's and Raglan's Cross, across from Five Bells to the railway, the trails and paths of everyday walkers, dogs and field mice, timid frogs and twice shy hedge bound birds. This world is ours bound up in hills and coastline, in running streams and sunshine. This beauty, this unrolled foothold of undeniable, verifiable wonder. Days here are precious, special, and the essence of splendour, and given. In honest admission, we recognise that what mesmerises us is not of our own making. We take in the vistas, Whisper our joy and acknowledge that we drink in what we have not brewed. Our souls are renewed by something created by someone greater. The burning pink sunsets that kiss the channel, deer inviting dawnscapes that ooze with nature's doe-eyed excellence, shade dapple pauses amid the sublime sunshine. These are not our handiwork the unmistakable hints of God's unique creative fingerprints are on this Somerset landscape, shaped by his divine blueprint. What we love is a gift, present to us, presented to us, superfluous but wondrous. All thanks to him, the maker of heaven and earth, this earth, this place, this space. Thanks be to God.